Well, when it comes to the Indianapolis Motor Speedway, we are literally on the road again for one of the most unique weekends all season long, Brickyard Weekend. I'm Dave First, the preview of the Gallagher Grand Prix coming up on Saturday. Uh, this is really a racer's dream, right? Nowhere else in the calendar will you see IndyCar paired up with our friends from NASCAR. Naturally, it is at the world capital of racing, right? Think about this, though. This is the ninth time in the last four years that IndyCar has raced on the 2.4 mile 14 turn layout. Not a lot of surprises. We'll get to some of that here in a second, but maybe the most telling story are the drivers that really haven't performed all that well on the road course. I'm thinking about Scott McLaughlin. You just saw a picture of his. Average finish is 14th. David Malukas, his average finish is 18th on the road course. I mean, heck, Kyle Kirkwood, who just won the race at Nashville, his average finish on the road course, a whopping 21st. We'll see if these guys can do it as well. Alexander Rossi, he won here last year and really could be one of the guys that you could look forward to and could be a favorite uh, this weekend. Let's begin with Andretti Autosport. Rossi, he got the win for the team last year. Roman Grosjean has a pole in a couple of seconds. And then, of course, you've got Colton Herta, who won a race here last year, really could have won this event a year ago as well. Don't forget about Christian Lungard from Ray Hall Letterman Landing in a race. He made his debut here a couple of years ago. He has looked awfully good here with a pole and a podium. And down here at Ed Carpenter Racing, don't forget about Renus VK, putting the V in VK here. And well, Team Penske, of course. Joseph Newgarden's got a win on the road course. No one has done any better, though, than Will Power. So could all those guys once again rise to the top and maybe finish on the podium? But here's the thing. There's four races remain in the 2023 NTT IndyCar Series season. When you're talking championship, eventually you got to talk about the guys under this tent right now. I mean, Alex Pillow, really it's down to two things this season. Alex Pillow has played his luck out brilliantly. On the flip side, everybody else is just jealous about this guy. I mean, his worst day would be taken by half the field this year. 84 point lead, and well, by the way, has won here last May. Could Alex extend that heading into Worldwide Technology Raceway here in a couple of weeks? We're going to see. Join us, IndyCar.com, the IndyCar app powered by NTT Data, all the telemetry. You got to check it out. 14 onboard views for you coming up on Saturday as well. You can listen to the world famous IndyCar radio network. And a reminder, you can see Saturday's Gallagher Grand Prix beginning at 2 Eastern, live on USA Network and streaming live on Peacock.